The Hebrew University was founded by Albert Einstein. It was his dream. The message was humanitarian responsibility, thinking for the next generation, responsibility for a science, and bringing the best of science to the world. We realize that you know, we have a tremendous opportunity with the centennial of Albert Einstein's theory of relativity. What can we do to celebrate and further Einstein's legacy? The Einstein Legacy Project is actually a cluster of projects, each one of them been thought and created individually. The projects include the Genius Book. A 3D publishing milestone will showcase the collective vision of the greatest thinkers, artists, and icons of our time. The Dinner of the Century, hosted by the Smithsonian Institute in Washington, D.C., will launch the Genius Book and convene the greatest innovators and minds on the planet. The Einstein Archive and Visitor Center will celebrate the life and legacy of Albert Einstein. Finally, opening the Einstein archives to the world. The archive will also serve as a hub for scientific collaboration. Opening a visitor center in the new Einstein home will be attractive to the general public because it will allow students, school children, tourists, and everybody else to appreciate the Einstein phenomenon. The Smithsonian Science Education Center and Hebrew University will leverage the 100th anniversary of Einstein's general theory of relativity. So I cannot imagine a better organization than Hebrew University to collaborate with to develop these projects to try to discover the next Einstein. And there's no better time than now. We've been part of a movement on the part of Hebrew University to internationalize much more. Using the name of one of its illustrious founders, Albert Einstein, gives it tremendous opportunity. The collaboration of those friends groups with the Hebrew University and now with the Smithsonian Institution, a, a remarkable place of massive size that's very committed to international uh, education. And I should note that this is the first time that the Friends organizations all over the world are collaborating as one. So again, it's the culture of Einstein that has brought everyone together, which makes it such an exciting uh, initiative. So from the collaboration between the Smithsonian and Hebrew University, we expect great things to come. But in some ways, who Albert Einstein was is the most relevant person for our age today. The, the need for human curiosity, the need for the tenacity behind human curiosity. So to me, Einstein, in a moment where the world has a lot of struggles, is really aspirationally somebody we can all be because he wasn't an academic elitist. He was a very human person uh, who really had the human curiosity and tenacity to think of ideas no one thought of before. And I think that's the kind of vision and the kind of um, legacy that I'm sure Einstein was hoping to, uh, to further and entrust Hebrew University with. The DNA of Einstein is the Hebrew University. So the mission of our university, says Einstein, in his words 90 years ago, is to be the one who feels the needs of the world, the serious reflection of science, and to be of inspiration to the world, and we try to follow his way.